Meet Lucy. Like many farmers, Lucy has three chickens and has struggled to grow her flock even though her hens hatch throughout the year. Lucy does not know that chickens are like money in the bank. If all the chicks that were hatched had survived, by now she would have sold them for thousands of shillings. Lucy could have invested that money in her homestead. Sadly, most of Lucy's chicks are eaten by predators or killed by diseases. But with three simple steps, Lucy can stop these losses and grow her flock. She can protect her chicks from predators, vaccinate her chicks against Newcastle disease, and prevent the spread of other chicken diseases. First, Lucy can protect her chicks from predators. Predators like eagles prevent Lucy from growing her flock. When Lucy leaves chicks unprotected, she is giving predators free food instead of saving her money. Lucy can protect her chicks by penning, keeping them inside, tethering the hen close to the main house so her chicks stay nearby, keeping a dog to chase predators away, and coloring chicks with GV. Purple chicks don't look like food to eagles. For every 10 chicks lost, Lucy is losing 6,000 shillings. By protecting the chicks, Lucy will quickly grow her flock. Second, Lucy can vaccinate against Newcastle, a disease which comes twice a year and kills most of the chickens in the village. The signs of Newcastle disease are green droppings, coughing and struggling to breathe, swollen neck and eyes, and twisted neck. Lucy's neighbor has tried using herbs, but they cannot cure this disease. And once the chicks are sick, it is too late and the birds are lost. Lucy is learning to prevent Newcastle disease spreading through her flock by vaccinating. The vaccine is an easy and affordable eye drop. Lucy should vaccinate her healthy birds every three months. If a farmer has no money to vaccinate her chicks, she can exchange a bird or eggs as payment. When the chicks grow up, Lucy will make thousands of shillings. Remember, you cannot vaccinate an already sick bird. Third, to prevent the spread of disease in her flock and village, Lucy should manage introducing new birds and correctly dispose any dead birds. <laughs> Lucy's new bird might be sick and spread disease to her existing flock. She should isolate the bird for seven days to see if it has any symptoms and introduce it to her flock only if it is healthy. Lucy used to throw away dead birds where other birds or dogs could easily eat them or carry them around the village. This can spread diseases. Lucy can stop this by burying birds that died of disease. Just like Lucy, you can grow your flock with these three simple steps. Protect them from predators, vaccinate them against Newcastle, and prevent the spread of diseases. Now that you've learned how to keep your birds alive, start protecting and vaccinating your birds today. Watch your flock grow and enjoy your profits. Every chicken in Lucy's flock is like money she has saved. She's now planning to sell some of her birds to pay school fees, and add a new roof on her house. She will also invest in keeping an improved breed of chicken since she has learned to keep her birds alive. <laughs>